We'll go back to another video. It's the one only pocket. And today we're going to be talking about Sneeko dissing Chris from Mr. Beast. Let's get right into it. So Sneeko dropped this video saying, Chris from Mr. Beast is now a trans woman. We need to approach this delusion with empathy. Hashtag love speech. And yeah, we're going to react to this video. So roll it. Chris from Mr. Beast. So people saw this picture. You can see him in the replies. Mr. Beast is like, is backing this up. He's like, opinion to relevant ratio. Here's what the ratio. The Chris I know was like a truck driving, AK-47 shooting, Call of Duty playing, dip chewing. Yep, that was Chris. What the fuck happened? The people that are encouraging this, they're not, they think that they're doing the right thing. They're all brainwashed. Even Mr. Beast thinks that he's doing the right thing by supporting his friend Chris. Brainwashed. If you really cared, you would not encourage his delusion now. Wow, so do you guys agree with Sneeko? The thing is, Sneeko's a very honest person, so he's gonna tell you exactly how he feels about it. I respect the honesty because most people would be scared to voice their opinion online. But now let's talk about it. Is it really a delusion to be supporting your friend? No, I don't think it's a delusion. I think Mr. Beast is being a supportive friend. It doesn't just mean that, you know, they got brainwashed either. You gotta just realize that people genuinely do feel this way. Like, that's just a very, very possible solution. I know a lot of people, it's hard to hear that and hard to understand that, but it's true. A lot of people genuinely just feel this way and yes you can definitely get influenced he's using the word brainwash like what he really means to be saying is they're getting influenced off of social media yes they're getting influenced they're seeing things like this and then they think about it and then they end up feeling that way i think that is definitely what's happening i don't think that's any sort of delusion i don't think people are getting brainwashed the world is changing it's definitely a different place and i understand and if you're saying you know you can't respect it because of you know your religion i totally understand that too a lot of religions are against this yes and that's just true but we just got to think about a human being like is chris tyson actually a bad human being like we really got to start looking at that if he's not a bad person and he's still taking care of his son, I think we just gotta let them live their life. You would look at the long term and see that this is something that he's doing because he is brainwashed by social media, because he's living in the West where this is pushed by a bunch of garbage. If you were really his friend right now, you would hear what I'm saying, because someone's gonna clip this and send it to him. You would tell him you've made the wrong decision. Transgenderism is a legitimate mental illness, believing that you're something that you're not. You say anorexia is a mental illness and it's believing that you're a different body weight. How is it not a mental illness to think that you're a different gender? Now that's obviously an extremely controversial take. Do you guys agree with that? Do you think it's a mental illness? And I know what Sneeko said is either going to make a lot of people really agree and respect him or it's going to make a lot of people really mad and disrespect him and not like him at all. But honestly, what do you guys think? Let me know down below in the comments. Someone replied to Sneeko and said, if bro wants to live his life on hard mode and pretend to be a woman, who cares? Can't save everyone. Grown adults can live with consequences of their own actions. I was trying to say that hey if chris tyson is making this decision let him live it if he ends up regretting this decision let him understand that and then like the who cares part is exactly what i'm saying like it's not our lives i've also seen this video right here even jimmy looks a little awkward and sad about chris doing this and i'm gonna roll it while we're talking in the background basically someone said it's the effect from carl but he also said he's just being himself but it's sad knowing he left his wife and his kid for this lifestyle i will say that he did not leave his kid he's still with his kid but yeah guys that is it for the video if you enjoyed this hit the like button subscribe if you're new and like we always say empire out